Viking 676 Palladium a PI compliant pump. Viking has just stepped up promotion of their new 676 Palladium range, so we thought it would be a good time to review their offerings for chemical, petrochemical oil and gas process applications. The 676 Palladium pump series, the first internal gear positive displacement pump to be fully API 676 compliant. Talking to the team over at Viking, they said that designing the 676 Palladium pump actually made them reevaluate their design process. And the R&D needed to design a pump to meet the API 676 standard. This has actually had a trickle-down effect for how they design the rest of their pump range going forward. The name of the game in here is Risk Mitigation. While you can use pumps based on exceptions to the API 676 standard, it does mean that you are open to risks and that you must have risk mitigation strategies in place, many of which can be more expensive to enforce than just using a compliant pump in the first place. Here's how using Viking Pump 676 Palladium pumps will help you minimize risk. Reduced risk of over unplanned downtime. API 682 seals will operate for 25,000 hours. The 676 Palladium S thrust bearing are designed to three times the L10 lifespan. These pumps are meant to be operated at relatively low speeds to extend the seal, bearing life while providing higher energy efficiency. These pumps also have options for hard parts for abrasive liquids or contaminates. So these pumps can be customized for most chemical, petrochemical oil and gas process applications. Reduced risk of leakage. The cost for even a small petrochemical spill can be outrageous, so Viking has used static O-ring seals to provide improved sealing compared to flat gaskets. As part of their quality control process, each pump undergoes non-destructive evaluation of welds and castings to ensure compliance. Pumps also feature cast and drains so that the pumps can be drained prior to service. Reduced risk of VOC emissions. You can use your plant standard API 682 seals in order to remain compliant with your environmental permit. Double seals can be used if you have more restrictive permits than the standard 1 ppm. The pump's class 300 flanges exceed the specified forces and moments for vapor-tight sealing at the inlet discharge and drain. Reduced risk of corrosion failure. The 676 Palladium pumps have an additional 3 mm corrosion allowance over the MACP on pressure-containing components. They just have more steel in them than other pumps so that they last longer. Viking can cast custom alloys in-house to meet your needs, so everything remains above API 676 standard. Viking can also comply with any customer paint specifications that you need. Reduced risk of overpressure failure. 676 Palladium use 80% more steel than the equivalent pumps in Viking standard range. The Viking XPD uses grade WCC steel with a 40,000 psi minimum yield. If you are looking to drive down the total cost of ownership of your pumps in an API 676 compliant environment, then get in touch with us here at Pi Barker. We'll review your existing operation or plans for your new process and recommend a pumping solution for you. Call our team on 404-363-6000 or drop us a line at sales at piabarker.com.